Hey everybody, it's Tracy from Mindless Crafting and Bill. 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 I apologize in advance. <laughs> ah, no need to apologize, right? It's really cloudy in here, so I'm trying to get the lighting right so that I could see if, you know, if everything is okay. So I'm wondering if y'all can see okay here because it got really dark outside. I mean, really dark. So I just want to make sure that y'all can see everything. Let me try this one second. Hey, Kathy Champion, how are you? Just trying to test out the lighting because it looks like it's been raining a lot. <laughs> oh, everyone's saying it's clear. But that's how it looks right there without the light. She on. says it's, um, Kathy says uh, everything is clear. I'll okay, do, good. It might be better with the light on. So we're just testing out the lighting. Only during the live, right? <laughs> hey, Janny. How are you? Not Janny Van. Okay, everyone can see fine. How are y'all doing? Look at this image right here. Look at this right here. What do y'all think? What do y'all think about this right here? Hartley has a house now. Hartley... And heavenly have a house. Isn't that? I'm so happy. Well, Hartley so we're gonna happy. we're gonna have fun because I'm gonna cut out their house. <laughs> oh, Mary says it's beautiful in Dallas. Nice. Oh, I'm so glad that y'all get. We've had rain for the last couple of days. Last couple of days. So it's been like really, um, it's just been dreary, okay? We are having a fantastic Thursday. We're having a fantastic Thursday. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. So here's Hartley's house. And I wanted to let y'all know that um, Hartley's house is available on our website and it's free so it's a free download it's right on the website it's right on the website it says free download so this is my birthday month but i'm giving y'all free gifts okay hartley's house is free on the website it's super easy to download it put your email address in there and, and you can there, use it in your card making right put your email address in and then you just it goes downloads. right to you you can start making something today Robin Renninger said, are you serious? About what? Hartley's house? <laughs> Yay, let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Happy birthday to me. Oh, my birthday. Hey, y'all. I it's got her today. Me and Kathy's birthday. Yeah, we have a story time for y'all, okay? <clears throat> but me and Kathy, our birthdays are on the same day. They're sisters. We didn't tell y'all that. Yes. <laughs> You're so welcome, Angela. Angela said, thank you for Hartley's house. I can't wait to see what y'all do with it. So what I started doing is you can put it on white paper and that's good for your card making, color it in. That's what I'm going to do today. But you can also, look what y'all can do. You can print it out on patterned paper. So I thought I'd have fun because the house can be whatever your color you want it you to want. be. It's just up to you. You could, look, I made small houses big one. So I had John come up with a image. Um, and so this is what he came up with. This is the dog house. Yeah. <laughs> That's cute. Um, so I did it in different sizes. You can make cards out of them. You can do cute little three by three cards. I did it on some darker paper just to see what it would look like. And then I did it on this pattern paper too. So I was just trying to experiment with putting it into my printer. Oh, you're so welcome. Christine said, thank you for the birthday gift. Yes, I'm giving away stuff for my birthday. I just feel like I need to, right? I it makes me feel good to be able to give. <laughs> the, can't, the cat stamp in digital. No, the, whatever's in digital will stay in digital. Whatever is in uh, the physical stamp sets will remain in the physical stamp set. Well, Jenny's overseas, huh? Janny is overseas, I believe. Yeah. Janny, where where do you live? 
I live on Earth. Jenny is overseas, I believe. She's like, I live on Earth. She's like, I live in a house. You know? Okay, so let me get my scissors here. So I can start cutting these out because this looks super fun. So I'm going to cut this one out because I'm going to use this for Heavenly. I, I see her in a house that has... Uh, this would be my house, okay? <laughs> it's just so creative and, and cute. And it's so easy to cut out. And so when John, I told him, give it some texture, he put some texture on it too. Well, you know what? Let me just cut this out to make it easier for myself. Just cut around here like this. Just cut around here. But I like to save all my little scraps so y'all know how I am. Yeah, so this is super easy to cut out. I thought it'd be nice to give do a giveaway for y'all on this. Just, you know, giving it away. It's free, so you can go test it out. If you're not sure about the digitals, we have actually six digital stamp sets um, out. And, and we're, we're getting ready to unleash another one on y'all. Exactly. <laughs> Along with the physical stamp sets, um, I think we're doing, are we doing releasing that tomorrow or Saturday? Yeah, tomorrow. Friday or Saturday? Hmm. More than likely to be tomorrow. We'll see. Uh, chance is pretty strong. Saturday? It It'll probably be tomorrow. But it may be Saturday. I don't know yet. Let's not talk about it. Until <laughs> about that. Something's going to be released tomorrow and something is going to be released on Saturday. That's all we know <laughs> for now. Thank you, Kathy. She says, Kathy says, I would like to remind everyone to make sure you click on the like button. Oh, y'all so sweet. Oh. So now what you could do is if you want, you can cut out this little piece right here. If you want, you don't have to. But if you want to, because it's your house, right? You can do whatever you want with your house. Right. And then you could add it to your card or whatever. If you don't want to cut out that piece, you don't have to. But what you could do is you can add in another background. Well, I guess I might need to show you, huh? Let's see. Hi, Donna. Donna Sadler says, why can't I find Hartley's house? Donna, go to the website, mindiscrafting.com, and right on the front page, right underneath the stamps, the first row of stamp sets, and right above, be a mermaid stamp set. You're going to see free digital download, Hartley's Dog House, with an image of a house. It's right on, we put it right on the front page for y'all. You just have to scroll down. Look how cute that looks. Now you can actually take this and make that, or you can put a, some, you can put like polka dots on the inside if you want. It, it's up to you what you want to do with this. So let me just put this here. Denise Payne like says you're just like her sister who was also born in March. She also gives gifts on her born day. Oh. Tracy, what well, it is, Tracy can't wait, so she just has to do something. So she says, I'll just give a gift because I can't wait. Just give something away. Just the whole thought of a gift is just I, you know, salivating. Yeah. <laughs> something Hi, like Crystal that. Talbert. Crystal, go get your freebie. Barbara Lamb says you can cut three sides of the opening and make it a door. Oh, you could do that too. Or you could get you a could black put, piece of paper. You and could it, it have it. Black. I have black right there too. And it'll look like uh, you can have the black inside too. You could do that too. I'll, I'll do that because I have some black paper right there. You could get black and put humpers on it, and it'll, it'll create the illusion of uh, inside of of, of of the dog going inside of something. Now that's true too. Hmm. All these wonderful ideas. Kathy oh. says, just celebrate the entire month. I'm celebrating the entire month. Marty Lamb says, put the sentiment behind the door. You could do that too. What a salivating. good idea. Y'all, this is free. <laughs> just go get it. Margie Ryan says, she's waiting to, after the show to go get it. Okay, good. Exactly, Margie. Margie's like, I am not missing a thing. Look how cute that is. Is Donna over here? You can, I, can, I can stamp a sentiment in there, too, if I want. So you can make little... You could actually make some things first. Um, you know, little sentiments or whatever. So let's go ahead and stamp that real quick. And then I'm going to put it to the side. And maybe we'll work with it. I like this style of crafting where you just... Where it's mindless. I know, like, you don't know that already, right? <laughs> where it's just mindless and I could just do my own thing. 
Oh, wouldn't it be nice to put the little... Oh, I could do a little... Y'all got me. I'm, I'm over here thinking, y'all. Y'all are seeing this in real time. I'm all over the place. So Bill threw me off this morning. This is why I'm all over the place. It's Bill's fault. He got me today. I got her. I like to know what, what's going to be happening during my day. She, um, I can't I, make a move. I, I like okay. to just kind of know what's going on. You know, just all of these little things. It's just me. If I even step out of the way. And so y'all, do y'all want to know what he did for my birthday? He can't, uh -huh. he can't surprise right. me on my birthday. All right. Because the closer I get, she, she monitors every 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 movement okay <laughs> anytime i even look like i'm walking out of the or anything and god forbid i walk towards the door which is what i did i was downstairs and my youngest my excuse me, my daughter calls she says hey where's ariel because what happened unbeknownst to tracy i arranged to have chelsea flown in from washington to surprise her for a birthday for washington dc y'all and uh, so the moment I started walking to the door, well, actually, I, I told her, I was whispering, so oh my God, Ariel was supposed to pick her up, but Ariel had the wrong day. And we we're like, oh my God, well, I have to get you. So uh, hmm. I went out the door and I was still talking on the phone to Chelsea. I said, Chelsea, she's going to call me before I even get out of the subdivision. True to form, I didn't even get to the corner. Ring. I was like, where you going? <laughs> My man rushes out the door. I had to make up something. Early in the morning, I need to know where he's going. <laughs> hey. He, I've never seen him move so fast. Even if I say, Bill, I need such and such for the grocery store. I've never seen him move so fast. I need to know why he's moving out the door so quickly. And then I told her I had to go to the store. Of course, I had to hear... Well, you should have told me. I could have got the list. We could have got this. We could have got that. I'm so sorry. Yes, but you could have this and that and that and that. So I had to tell you. I said, yeah, I guess I should have been thinking. You did say I'm that, so too. Sorry. He was very quiet about it. Non-combative. He's I like, I'm on, beat up on me a little he's bit. like, I'm on a mission right now. Okay. I took the pain because I knew the pleasure. And then she was, when I came, we finally drove up from the airport downtown. So it took a considerable amount of time to fight our way through the traffic because it's raining down here also. She was in the garage, so she didn't really hear Chelsea come in. And nothing. So this was, she says, hey, so-and-so, this and that. She was looking at this one board with her back to us, and Chelsea came in behind her. Caught her off guard. Ooh, that's a good one. They had me crying. I was crying, too, just looking at her crying. They had me crying. Wasn't that a sweet surprise? That was a good one. Y'all got me. Ooh, that was hard to surprise me. Y'all don't understand. <laughs> so my first thing was, who else knew? I want to know who else Everybody. knew. Everybody. Everybody except for you. Even the dog looked like he knew. <laughs> the dog looked like... <laughs> Isn't that the sweetest? I just had... Couldn't even... I just couldn't hold my tears, y'all. See my oldest daughter. And I hadn't... We weren't able to go like and celebrate her birthday with her. Um, Her birthday was in February. So... I hadn't seen my 27-year-old in person. So I get to see my 27-year-old. And she's downstairs working She's actually online. working, yes. I'll have her come up here and say hi to y'all. She said she was going to come up and say hi, so. Uh, G. Dixon. They got me. Okay, G. Everybody, G. Dixon. She says, I can't find Hartley's house on the site. Hmm. Go to Mindless Crafting. The first thing you see... Is, is that big picture of the mermaid. Scroll down to the next thing. It says, our high-quality photopolymer stamp sets, and you see four stamp sets. The very next thing you see is an image of a house, and it says, free digital download, Hartley's Doghouse. Enter your email right there. Underneath that, you see another Be Your Mermaid stamp set. Can you pull it up on your phone, babe, so we can just show them the screen? Okay. All right. Your phone. Uh, all right. Yeah. Go back here. Okay. So Chelsea just came in the door. She must have heard us talking about her. Chelsea, say hi. Hi. Wave your hand in here. Oh, my nails are all messed up. Your yeah. nails look great. Okay. Just I'll say wave hey. I'll this many because my. <laughs> you know what? Just <laughs> waving at y'all. <laughs> Chelsea, I was telling them how how y'all surprised me. 
and Bill is talking about how hard it is to surprise me. Okay. And I had talked to Chelsea on the phone too. Here's the website, right? Okay, Bill's gonna. <laughs> here's the first thing right here. Here's the stamp set. The very next thing says right. that. There you go. You're right. So you'll be able to find it. It's pretty easy. It's right on the first page. Everyone's saying, hey, Chelsea. Hi. Chelsea is. You left. What time did you fly out this morning? Like, my flight was at 6 a.m. She flew out at 6 a.m., y'all, which means she had to be at the airport at like 4. 4 o'clock. So, so glad. And then you know what she tells me this morning? She's like, um, I want a public sandwich. Do they not? They don't have Publix in DC? No, they don't have Publix. Wow. Donna Sally says she still don't see it. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything to do with the free. Huh. That is so strange. Donna, are you on the website? Yeah, it's right there. It's on the home page, Donna. Yep, it's right on the home page. Cause did anyone else? Okay, who did find it? Everyone else. Uh, Kathy says she found it. Oh, Tracy has to know how much courage her words have inspired in me. Everyone tell oh, me. Oh, you're so welcome, say Carmen. It's, it's on the home page. So everyone has found it. It's free. It's a free digital download. Go get it. Donna says free digital download. Hartley's Doghouse. Um, she's she'll find it. She's gonna um. I think Kathy's gonna walk her through it after the live. Maybe I need to move it and put it right underneath that. Uh, I didn't want to confuse you by putting it right under the that big scrolling thing, but maybe I need to. Wait, maybe we'll put it up closer, up to the top. Uh, maybe we can rework it a little bit. Yeah, put it up closer. Okay, Angela found it. Uh, Vicky found it. Sorry, y'all. I'm going to have to make it easier. It, Let's it'd be, see. That's good. This is a good test. because It is a good them. test. So y'all are getting to test the, free, the first free We're download. We're testing, testing it out on you. Look at that. I love that. That's It's coming out good. Hi, Brian. Now, what you could do, hey, Brian Dickey, you could actually color in this other part. If you want to shade it in, you can, you know. So that's what I'm doing right now, just shading it in here. Just want to add more color. I, I'm tempted to put stitching in there. I haven't done stitching for a while. Jenny, did you find it, Jenny? I hope so. One thing, one reason, one real big reason why we wanted to do digital uh, stamps was because we had so many people overseas where shipping could be a barrier. And that was a, it was a really helpful because they could get it without having to pay a large shipping cost for customs and stuff like that. Not to mention they can get those stamps instantaneously. That's one major reason why we did that. There you go. Hi, Pam Tabor. Hey, Pam. She's waiting for the refrigerator repairman. Oh, I thought she was going to say refrigerator stamp set. <laughs> I, I thought she was going to say she's waiting for the refrigerator stamp set. I was like, what? <laughs> these are so easy to cut out, too. So I have a bunch of these that I'm going to be uh, working with. But that looks so cute with the bone little thing on the... See, this in itself can be a tag. And then you take Hartley, maybe put them on the outside. If you want to put them like right here to do some layering, you know, when you build your card. So it's just up to you. Let's see what y'all are saying. Oh, B and D Craft said I'm. She says I'm working on something for you right now. Now I probably missed a lot of comments because I've been going back and forth seeing my phone. B and D Crafts is Brian Dickey. Yes. He. Sorry, Brian. <laughs> Brian is working on something for me, huh? So I guess I'm gonna have to do a couple of happy mail videos, huh? Yvette Daniel says that's cute. What about brick or foxwood paper? 
That is a good idea. Right, you could just put yep. it. And he already put the texture just in case. Yeah, so I did the, um. let's see. I did it using um, this one too. I wanted to see what it looked like. So I just downloaded, remember you can size it in different sizes. A dog house, I know Pam Tabor, it's a good idea. By M. So this is a free digital. So go get your free digital. It's on the main, it's on our website, on the front page of our website. You just have to scroll down just a little bit to find it. So you got to put a dog there somewhere, huh? Well, we'll see. I'm just building the house right now. So this is just another thing you can do. Um, and I can color it in whichever color I want. If I want it to go. I like the lighter brown. So we can do the, we could just do the regular brown if we want. And see, I'm just kind of, I'm not really... coloring it in perfectly because I wanted to have that little bit of texture so it doesn't have to be perfect here. See what y'all are saying? Yeah, it is raining. Now the rain, the rain is pouring down a lot now. Um, and whatever what happens in our subdivision, if it rains too much, you can't get out the front part of the subdivision. Area uh, Chelsea talking about she wants that um sandwich from Publix. Oh yeah, <laughs> Chelsea's been online with you know is a apparently there's a special Facebook group or something just for this particular sub sandwich on Facebook. The chicken sandwich. That it's there. a good sandwich. I don't know if y'all have ever had if y'all have a Publix in your area. If you've ever had um, Publix is a grocery store, but their sandwich place. Oh my it's goodness. A sub sandwich. Yeah, the sub sandwich, um, they're having a special on it. So I guess I know what we'll be having today. <laughs> Except for me, I'll get something else. Some sub sandwiches. It's too much bread for me. Yeah. Now you're going to make me feel guilty. No, don't feel guilty. I'll just You've been get doing something good, else. though. I'll find something. Oh. Probably what happened with Donna, she probably needs to refresh that particular browser. I bet she went right in. And it, oh, she probably has it a already up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is fun. Christine Emmerich says she's really excited to have crafting time. There always seems to be too much going on to carve out craft time. I know. We got to have our crafting time because that's, that's our sanity. <laughs> we don't want to start tearing stuff up. We got to keep our sanity here. Arthur Sweet. Hello from Sweetwater, Tennessee. Oh, hey. Oh, I hope, hope you guys are okay. I heard yeah, some tornadoes Tennessee. Down there. Yep, Tennessee did have a tornado. So we're hoping that everything is okay in your neck of the woods. Exactly. I got to cut this a little bit neater. All right, guys, we're going back to see what I missed. I'm sure there's a lot of stuff. Vicki Jensen says, you have new stamp sets. It's coming. Let's see. Oh, um, is she talking about the uh, which ones? Because we have the digital, which are new still, fairly well, new. Yeah, but we have another one. Week out, but we have another digital coming. And then on Saturday, I believe, we're, we're going to have the physical, physical stamp set released also. So, yeah, we got some stuff coming. Hmm. <laughs> right. It, I'm excited because I'm thinking about it in my mind. Yeah. Possibly, Sarah. Maybe. We'll see. All right. Just unleash all of them together, huh? Yeah, because we have we we're scheduled to to um have four new physical stamp set releases, four of them during the month of March. So yeah, we're gearing up for a lot of stuff coming up for y'all. I'm just going to do this darker. Just letting y'all see what's possible with this. Carmen Wiley is telling you that she wants you to know how much you inspired her. Your words of encouragement mean so much to her. Oh, you went way back. I read that. Because uh -huh. she opened her own store 
Etsy. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh, my God. That makes me feel so good. Congratulations. That's a big step, guys. It really is. I, I just want y'all to break free and get, get past that thing that you've been wanting to do. Um, and you've been just kind of saying, mm, I don't think I can do it, you know? Well, if if not you, then who else? It's meant then to come not now. When it's it's meant to come through you. Because there's only one. There's no competition. Because there's only one you. Yep. Yeah. So good. Kudos to you. Kudos to you. It's not an easy journey, but it's very rewarding. You know. Kathy Champion has a store also. Exactly. Um, and so we're so super proud of her for even just opening up her her channel, um, She's making starting her channel, videos on there and starting her uh, store also. So it's just nice when you talk to people about certain things and hopes and dreams that they have, and then it actually comes, it comes to be, you know. And another thing, you'll be surprised <clears throat> that you have a voice, and a voice that is going to be very, very particular for a specific group of people who will only be able to identify mm -hmm. with you and you alone on, yep. that, on that particular platform. That's the kind I say, there's really no competition. People say, oh, what about the competition? No, you, it's not really competition. Just be you. The, the only, there's only one you. Your biggest job is to try to be the most authentic you that you can possibly be. Don't try to cop copycat anyone. Just try to be only yourself. Right. If you do that, you will find your people and your people alone that identify with you and the message that you're bringing. Does that make sense? It makes a lot As of sense. real horse feather, she says, oh, I needed this pep talk today. Oh. We have fun during our lives, don't we? Okay, so I'm just going to cut around this for now. I'm just winging this, y'all. Mardell Lamb says, thank you for the 25% off sale the other day. Oh, and oh. the coffee and donut stamp set. Yeah, she that's about she was crazy. She was trying to do a uh she she couldn't wait again. And she says, It's my birthday. I'm doing a sale. I'm doing I'm a, celebrating all my I'm said, celebrating okay, all there my you go. <laughs> I know. Bill was like, What? We hadn't planned for that. I'm like, but I just felt on my heart to do it, you know. So I'm glad for those of you that took advantage of it. And now we got this house we're giving away free, the dog house for Hartley. Yes, so go ahead and get um, it. So if you haven't gotten Hartley, you need to go ahead and get it because he's on two stamp sets. He's on the he's on the actually uh, love you. To... He's on the love you stamp set, and he's on the he's he is grown up. Him and Heavenly, the dog lover stamp set. So if you haven't gotten those two, I think they're still in stock, right? Yeah, yes, yeah, I don't want to jump the gun. <laughs> and I'm trying to create a construct because I'm going to be doing a. Changing up and doing a download, some kind of free download, uh, at least once a month, maybe top twice a month. We'll see. I have to figure out how to make it happen. I don't know quite know. I'm thinking it out right now. He's learning, y'all. And and I hope a lot of you have have taken advantage of looking at those videos on uh, how to use like Google uh, Docs. Google Docs, guys, are free. Everyone has Google, so Google Docs. How to use uh, Open Office. Uh, and if, Microsoft Word pages to manipulate those PNG files. And the thing is, if you have a Google Docs, a Google account, right, which most of us do, um, then you can use, you have Google Docs available to you for free. And when I went in there, because I haven't used it, I was like, well, what is Bill talking about? Let me go look at this Google Docs. Y'all, if you want to manipulate and download your images, your digital images, you can use Google Docs. It has so much. It's like using Word, or in my case, on uh, my Mac, I use Pages to manipulate my files, but it's so good. And you know what? Consider that Google Docs video part one, I'm going to be, in the next few days, I'm going to be doing a part two that's going to really go down into the nitty gritty of this thing, because you can do even more There's with Google so Docs much. In, as far as manipulating, because one thing I didn't go into is grouping. And I had to find that out. You'll see yeah. what I'm saying. But watch the first one first to get the basics. And that way, when we go to part two, it'll be a piece of cake. That way, you yeah. just go bananas with these images. Y'all have been doing posting some awesome cards using the digitals too in the group. 
in the Facebook group. So I'm really excited when I see y'all post and I'm like, okay, good. Hi, Lynn Kirsch. She says, just in for work, what am I missing? No, you aren't missing anything. We were missing you, Lynn. She might miss this free download, though. Exactly. You might miss that. <laughs> We have a free download of Hartley's house, Lynn. So, um, J Jenny says, Jenny Van Pollenden says, you can't make that camp stamp, that cat stamp digital. I like it. Oh. You know what? We'll, we, we can't do that one. We may have to make something new. We'll see. Something different. <laughs> Jenny's like, whatever. She's I want like, that one. I want that one. I don't care about nothing different. <laughs> Uh, Y'all are funny. Karma says, thank you from the bottom of her heart. Anytime, Carla. Oh, you're so Carmen welcome. Wiley. We're going to be sending y'all some other freebies, too, because I, I just love, um, you know, just making stuff. And we have images and stuff um, that we would love to be able to offer as a free download, just to say thank you to y'all for supporting us. Just really appreciate y'all supporting us. And the nice thing about these is that you can size them the way you want. I'm just kind of oh, cutting around this stuff here, y'all. Lynn Kerr says, do I need a printer to do this? Now, here's the thing. If you want to print them at your house, you need a printer. After you create, after you arrange you do, your digital. You do need a printer, yeah. Yes. However, if you wanted, did want a printer, you would have at least at the minimum get a thumb drive, arrange it, save it to your thumb drive, and you're still going to have to go out to a place like a Staples. Printing place, yeah. Some place that prints. So in that case, you might as well get a printer. Printers are almost, like you can get them for like, what, $40, $49. They're very inexpensive now. What it gets you at is on the ink. But since you'll be the only one using it, you know, you can kind of control Dead C says, I watched the one on Open Office last night and started making a card. Looking forward to seeing what Google Docs is like. Oh, you're going to love Google Docs. Oh, hold on. I will post the, um, I have a playlist with all like, I think there's four tutorials now that we, we recorded, right? Yes. It is four tutorials in a playlist that we recorded um, just to make it simple for you, you know, because I know a lot of people release digital stamp sets, but they don't really show you like how. And so we just want to, just kind of at least give you the bare minimum of the things you can do inside of um, right. and if you, of these programs to make it easier for you to access your digitals. And if you like like that part one, you be able to look out for part two of Google Docs. Exactly. Bill is learning. Don't let, look. He's he he's learning enough to be very dangerous here, y'all. <laughs> G Dixon got it. Oh, good. I'm glad you got it, Jim. Have fun. And you can size them the way you want, y'all. Kathy you can... has to go. Bye, Kathy. Right. See you, Kathy. Look at this. You can size them however you want. You want to make it little, have Hartley in the front, and have the little house in the back. You can... I mean, there's so much I you can do. I love them because you can rotate them. You can change the position. If, if a pair of scissors is going from, from, this, from left to right, you can flip it around where it goes from right to left. You know, change the size. The image, yeah. Put it in front, put it in back, all kind of things. And it's so easy. I'm trying to see if I had one where I had done that. Uh, flipped it around. But, um... Let me look. No, that's all right. I'll have to show you. I'll have to show you in a video. I think I did one. Let me see. I might have one right here. Let's see. I think I have one showing how I flipped it. Let's see. Um, da, 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 da. I think I have one downstairs. Oh, no, that's the, that's the new digital. I get one right I don't want to show the new digital. <laughs> right. I'll be back. I almost made y'all look at this. See the... um. Wait till y'all see that new digital stamp set. Y'all are going to love it. Let's see what y'all are saying. Oh, good. I'm so glad. Yeah, Bill, he explained it really well. He was like, how do you explain stuff when you're doing the card making? He's like, oh, my goodness. Because I could see him. He was down there recording it over and over. And I said, Bill, you'll he'll get it. He was recording it over and over again to make sure it was right so that y'all could understand it. 
He's so sweet. He's so sweet. Yeah, he went downstairs because he wants to show you how you can flip an image, um, flip a, an image around. So he went downstairs. Let's see what y'all are saying. That doghouse looks cute. There's so much I could do with it. Like Heavenly's house, I would probably add some bling to her house. I would add some bling to Heavenly's house, you know. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to do some, um, I think I'm going to do some blue. Let's see. Do this one with a little bit of blue around it. And if you hear pitter-patter in the background, that's the rain, y'all. Hadn't stitched in a while, so my my dog bone is gonna have stitching on it. It is pouring down out there, y'all. And my child flew in to see me for my birthday. Now she's flying out, of course, before my birthday because you know work. She has work to go back to. But just the fact that she's here and I get to see her and give her a hug and that just, so she's going to be here until Monday, which is nice. Hey, Marsha Freeman. Oh, greetings. Love, love, love the doghouse. Thanks so much for your generosity to us. You are so welcome. Thank you all for just being so generous to us and just being so supportive and supporting our business y'all have just been like it's like oh my goodness bill they're like right with us every step of the way and if we make a mistake here's how i like i just know that um let's see how can i put this here's how you can tell the character of the people that you're that follow you or support you. And I already knew it, but when we make a mistake with your order and y'all write to us, a lot of y'all write to us uh, mainly at our admin at mindlesscrafting.com. When y'all write to us, it's the way in which you say, Hey, Tracy, there was a mistake with my order. Hey, Tracy and Bill it was a mistake with my order. Um, and, um, you know, don't worry, I hate to bother you or, you know, just like, no, bother us because we want to know, like we, we want to make sure we get it right or no worries. And then I'll say, I'll write back to you and you say, I'll get it out to you like ASAP. And y'all are like, oh, no, what rush? I just wanted to let y'all know. I mean, it's just like the way that y'all say, y'all are so loving and kind. And so I'm just so like, it just blows me away because I mean, Sometimes you can get some really nasty comments and it's just so nice the way that y'all approach us in, you know, if we, if we make a mistake, you know, cause we're only human. <laughs> yep. So we try to make sure that we get it right. Bootsy sweethearts. How are you? Sweethearts. <laughs> Been a while. Yes, it has. Life is getting busy. All good. Hope all you wonderful people are well. We're doing well. We're just really um, excited to just be here. It's raining outside, but we're here. We love going live with y'all. I just have to tell y'all that. Um, if you didn't tune in yesterday, we had to take my mom to a doctor's appointment, but after we went live at her house, and she's a, a hoot. <laughs> So um, she gave me one of her uh, her crocheted um, her creations. She I was begging my mom to give me another one of her um, afghans. I'm gonna call it the right thing. One of her afghans slash crocheted blankets. <laughs> and she finally she wouldn't give it to me during the live, but she she gave it to me after. So I left there with a beautifully. Uh, crocheted afghan. OK, 
Okay, so look how cute that is. Look how adorable. Hey, Carmina, how are you? Okay, so I think Bill is printing out something. That's probably why he left for so long. He wants to really sh** this thing. Look, that would be cute with Hartley, like, right there, wouldn't it? And so now I'm just creating these so that I can put them in, you know, like, put them on a card. So I'm starting small, and then I'll get bigger. Bootsy, uh, how are your sis and brother-in-law? Haven't seen them in a, in a long time. I know. And I tell, I've tell i told them that y'all are missing them a lot. The Quilting Marine and my sister. And so life is busy. To be honest, life has been really busy for them. And so um, hopefully they'll be back soon, though. Um, hopefully they'll be back soon. That's all I can say. But they're doing good. We miss them as well. Hopefully they'll be back soon. What type of sandwich? Okay, so Chelsea is here. She's asking me what type of sandwich I want. <laughs> Chelsea, it's okay. She's whispering. She's so she's so I'm nice. To be polite, she's know. so nice being polite. Chelsea's here. She flew in this morning. She flew in this morning, y'all. That was a surprise for me. For those of you just tuning in, can you hear the excitement in my voice? <laughs> So um, Chelsea's asked me what kind of sandwich I want from Publix. I do want the um, chicken tender stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So the chicken tender sandwich, which is on sale now, right, Chelsea? Tell them. Yeah. There's a sale. This is oh yeah, there's a sale. It's like six ninety nine right now. Mm -hmm. For a whole sub. For a whole sub, and these are like good. So um, put a little bit of everything on mine. What are you getting? Um, <laughs> Vicky said, hey, Chelsea, I'll take a turkey on wheat, LOL. <laughs> right. <laughs> Carmen, send in your stuff. Corned beef for me with, um... <laughs> ooh, corned beef sounds good. I'm getting the chicken one. Ariel probably wants one too, right? Yeah, she's outside actually, so we're about to go. Oh, y'all about to, oh, yeah. Ariel just pulled up? Yeah, she did. Um, so, um... <laughs> Bootsies, get me a, I hope that's a spelling error, but it probably isn't. Get me a tongue on rye with spicy mustard. <laughs> then, yeah, sandwich. You know what? Let's go ahead and see what y'all favorite sandwich is. So, Chelsea, get me the chicken. Okay, what do you want? With the, um, you know, like tomatoes and... Just the standard stuff. On the wheat bread. Okay, on wheat. Okay, uh -huh. chicken tender stuff on wheat. Okay. What are you getting on yours? Like, you know, with the fixings and stuff? Yeah, I'm getting everything like jalapenos, all that good stuff. Oh, you're getting jalapenos. Do you want your chicken? Hmm. Oh, hey, Ariel. Sorry, y'all. We, we're ordering sandwiches during the live. Oh, we're doing what? Yeah, I'm trying to get Yeah, go ahead and get mine. <laughs> Deb C, y'all are making me hungry. I know, right? Okay. We're having a sandwich party today, okay? <laughs> And whatever else, you know, like the okay, tomatoes okay. and okay, yeah, no, I know. Yeah, do you like green peppers? Um, yeah, put those on there too. I know you like all vegetables, so it's pretty easy. Someone said they ate tongue when they was a kid. Look, let me tell you. Um, <laughs> let me tell you, I ate tongue when I was a kid, and I was okay with it. Until my mind started. As I got older, my mind started working with me. <laughs> my mind started working with me. And I was like, I'm eating the tongue of something. Okay. Like, here's an example. We were talking oh. about the different sizes okay. and, and rotating, flipping. What have you. Okay, so Bill went in. We got so much stuff going on here. We're talking about our sandwiches, babe. Oh, Okay. My great aunt used to make tongue. Yes, in in the um, uh, West Indian culture, tongue uh, for us that was the thing in our family was to have tongue. Um. <laughs> what? You have, have look, you've got to see how I'm looking at her. A big old tongue in the pan. A tongue. Look. Yes, it was sliced, and then I was like, Girl. Oh. "Look, Christine says I worked in a deli 
uh, that had a sliced tongue. I hated it. I was okay Hold with up. it, and it Ooh. tastes good. But once no. I started thinking about what uh -uh. it was, I was like, I'm, I'm done. I can't do you it. Know, you want to kill your man? You said give him some of his tongue. Hey, I cannot eat that. That sounds like a like a like a potion from an island. <laughs> yeah, let's get it tastes good, Bill. If I made you a tongue, I would not. You, you could not tell me. I wouldn't even tell you what it was. You'd be like, "Ooh, this oh, is good." Oh no, <laughs> mm -mm. no. Uh, I cannot know. Look, wait a minute. It tastes like roast beef. Malaya Branch. It sure does. Yup, it does. Malaya Branch says, uh, "We actually cooked the tongue uh, in junior high." Did y'all eat it? M junior Malaya? high cooking class. I bet Malaya didn't even take a take that take that one bite of it. Junior, high, you would think that junior high they'd be like, "What?" I'm a Dev C. I, I I just have to do a tuna sandwich, okay? So Bill, so here's what you Malaya were talking said. About. She, she said no. She didn't even she cooked it, but it, that's all she did was cook it. Because <laughs> I was gonna say junior high, you'd be it like, and "What?" Gave it to the, someone in gave the it hall. to the principal. <laughs> Hi, Brenda Bodwin. She says, I just woke up. Thank you so much, Brenda. She said, what? How much did I miss? And no tongue sandwich for her. She says she doesn't eat bread. But I'll take chicken bacon wrap. Oh, that sounds good. I don't eat bread either, Brenda. I read somewhere, and they were saying, like, if say you get a hamburger, instead of using the... Uh, the bread used celery. I mean, not celery, but uh, lettuce. So it's like a lettuce burger. Bill, I could have used this. Okay, oh, that's so, just regular paper. Right, this is regular paper. But, but I'm saying that on it. So what you did was, he, here's what he did. He layered, right? So he put the um, the blowfish on top of the mermaid, and then he took this one and put this one on the other side right. behind her and then he took this and he flipped it so you see how they're facing you can do that in any of those programs that in, we're talking about in your different sizes different sizes so you can resize it you can flip it on the other side you can layer it so could you imagine the possibilities and you don't have to stay inside the same stamp set you you once you have the digital images you can do anything. right you can use yeah you can use a you lot can use of whatever them. images you have you have yep. 500 images just play around and, and here's the beauty of it. Once you decide on whatever it is that you want, uh, and you use the grouping options, which I'm going to make a video and show you about that, you'll be able to lock those things in, size that entire group down, and then make multiples. Right. So your entire scene, you'll be able to take it and just condense it to a smaller right. size, which That's is what it. Bill's talking about with the grouping. I'm learning, y'all. I'm learning. Oh, they also said when you went downstairs... Um, that you your tutorial was very well done and easy to understand. Uh, I, just so you know. So thank you very much. I actually had to do open office over. I don't know what happened because I didn't change anything. I think it was a, a YouTube thing. But it lowered the volume. What programs you, did you use? What Christine Emmerich, I use all of them. Well, for that one, Bill. For that one, I used... Uh, I used... Actually, I used open office on that one. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing with Open Office. He likes it's open free. Office. See, okay, you have two programs. One is Open Office, and one is LibreOffice. If you know how to do Open Office, you know you know how to do LibreOffice because they're the same people. Hi, Wanda Lewis. Okay, they're the same people. That's yes, they're the name. same people. It's under a different name, and mm -hmm. the construct, even though. It looks just a smidgen different. It's the exact same thing. So, yeah. I'm going to use these alcohol markers. But I'm telling you. Color this one in. By the time I show you the, the next video on Google Docs, you may not use anything else, to be perfectly honest. The Google Docs, y'all. I was just like, because I'm, I'm, I'm kind of hooked on pages. But Google Docs, when I use that, I was like, oh, look at this. All the stuff I could do. June Scholar says, I got to learn how to use the digital stamp mermaid again. June, you can do it. Trust you can me. do it, June. Which is easy to use. All of them, June. Um, To me, well, I actually like pages, but I think Word would be quite easy, too, if you have Word. But Google Docs is really easy. All um, of them are easy. Yeah, they're pretty easy. 
if you use the drag and drop method, don't 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 try to go through the like the, the way you see it, like insert and all that. Just make the do it just like I said. Have one screen on the side. You can do the other way, but yeah. however, watch the videos and then yes. just choose what you like. You know, choose the one you like, but just drag it, drop it, drag it, drop it. It's so simple at that point. The Christine Emmerich says she uses Canva. You could you could do that. Oh also. yes, Canva's another one. Yeah. Vicky uses Word. Donna has to go. Bye, Donna. Thanks for coming. Yeah, so this, just so y'all know, the Hartley's House is a free download. For those of you that are just tuning in, this is a free digital download on the uh, front page of our website, mindlesscrafting.com. June says So just so y'all know. She's not clever like us. If I can do this, June. June. Trust me, I'm 60. Now, I can. if I can do this, I promise you, you can do it. And just watch that video, any one of them, and I guarantee you. Yeah, pick out, one, pick out a couple. Watch the whole um, playlist and see what... Well, stop, rewind that part, and look at it again. Yes, yeah, I think you'll get it the first time. You'll, you'll be like, be oh, that's it? But the fact that everyone has access, if you have a Gmail account or what, Google, you have a YouTube account, yes, right? You have right. access to... Um, Beth, definitely Google. To Google Docs. Google Docs was very easy. And the nice thing is when you have the digital stamp sets, you get to work with them immediately. No shipping to you. We just send them right in your email. Loopy says she had to do some deep cleaning at the library in the kids area because, you know, everyone is freaking out about the coronavirus. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I used to work at the library, so I know we would have to wipe down the keys and stuff just because just during flu season, there'd be so many things going on and we would just... Wipe down everything. I decided to make Hartley um, this little color here. I thought this would be cute for him. Let's see. Having so much fun doing this, y'all. And I'm going to cut him out and put him, like, I'm going to put him right off to the side of his, well, I could put him, like, kind of in the doorway, but he's standing in front of the house kind of thing. That's what Hold I up. see. Deb C says, since I can't fussy cut right now, I'm thinking about making the entire card in the app and then printing it out. I found it where to resize the card page. Oh, this yeah. Deb C did the, uh, uh, Deb. Aren't you the one that did the card or uh, did the image using paint? Is that DFC? Um, I'm not sure. Mal Malaya, 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 uh -huh. Malaya. I'm sorry, I'm messing your name up. I'm having a rough time deciding what to order in the digital stamp set. I love them all. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Brenda. She says people should be freaking out about the coronavirus. It's real and it's here. It is. Take we take precautions. Y'all take precautions. Yes, please. Tracy for years used to have tried to get me to get the uh the hand sanitizer and I use it marginally, please. I'm slapping that stuff on like my like Will Smith did uh uh Robertussin and Hitch now. I heard a lot of the stores are running out of that stuff, too. Oh, Margie was saying her, uh, her husband. Yeah, Margie's husband did help her get it rolling. That's so good, Margie. Your husband said, I got to keep her. I got to keep Margie in that room. Let me show how to use this. <laughs> he did so not say that. Stay in there. Oh, so that's the reason why, huh? <laughs> Y'all. June talking about, oh my gee, oh my God, I'm 65 in June. I'm old. Girl, you young. You, you 65 young. years young. You sure are. Did you see my mother yesterday in the video? We went live with her. She's 85. You see how much energy she has, right? 
And then the thing is, she called me this morning. She was like, because Bill said he needed a hat. So she went and um, she knitted him a hat overnight and called me this morning to tell me, hey, it's, it's ready. ready. <laughs> she crocheted a hat for him. Brenda Bowers says she has to unbox her new laptop so she can grab Ooh, some digital. Oh, she got her. She saw the tutorial. It looks simple enough. Brenda is ready, okay? Brenda's ready. Brenda's ready. I learned, look, I learned how to use Google Docs watching Bill's tutorial because <laughs> I didn't know how to do it. And then I ended up um, doing some images, some digital images yeah. for our new stamp set. We got a new digital coming out. So I went ahead and, and said, hey, I might as well just go ahead and jump right in. If you like that first, like I say, I can't say enough. If you like that first Google Docs video, wait till you see part two, please. This is going to be cute. Look at that. Bill, look at the colors. Loopy says, your mom is cute and full of energy. Oh, it is. I like that. <laughs> Tracy, that is cute. That is going to be good. I'm excited about it. Carmina says, your mom is so sweet, Tracy. She is sweet. Gina Poss says, your mom is amazing. I just love her. Y'all are like family. Yes, and, and look, if you didn't know, <laughs> she, you would not know that she is completely blind in one eye. So she has her one functioning eye. And so we took her to her um, eye doctor yesterday so she can just get her checkups. So we make sure that she gets in there and gets her checkups um, quite often. And there's some partial So loss that we can make sure. In the other eye. Right, so she has some partial loss in the other eye, but do you think she lets that stop her? She's like, I got this one eye. She said, God bless me with this one eye, and I'm going to use it. We're like, but you only got one eye. Well, look through it. <laughs> right. People you know will focus saying? on the eye that they lost and not focus on what they still have, right? So, yeah, she's a gem. Brenda Bible says she has enough hand sanitizer, disinfectant wipes, spray cleaner, and masks for 100 people for a year. Mm. She couponed it. She's laughing. <laughs> I was on Amazon looking for stuff. Hold up. Look at this. Naomi. Tra she said, Naomi says, Tracy, is she going to crochet you the blanket? No. Tracy, I thought you put that, bit, that, that picture up. Tracy got that blanket and walked out that house. Is she gonna? She oh yeah, dancing. she. It's a blanket that's already done. Hold on, she only had about what twenty five of them. <laughs> she in got a bunch of different clothes. My mother is hoarding place. her stuff. I said, Mom, when I go over there, her. Well, they saw that she she had them in the shower, y'all. Ooh. She had them in the shower. Okay, all of her blankets that she's made, and the shower is full right now. So from top to bottom, her shower is completely full. The, she that she calls it hiding them. <laughs> and some of you said um i was looking at the comments and you asked where is your mom from and my mom is was born on an island british ruled island called Montserrat, and um that's where she's from some people think of antigua it's close to Antigua. Montserrat is very close to Antigua is like the sister island. Brenda Bible says another good selling point is you can't catch Corona from a digital download. <laughs> well, there you go. Jenny, Jenny Van Pollen says, Pollen says, I'm very curious what the new digital stamp will be. You're going to love oh, it. Oh, my goodness. You're going to love it, Jenny. Uh, wish I could see. You're going to love it. Now, you'll see it. We, matter of fact, we could do, probably at least that one tomorrow. What do you think? Or should we do both at the same time? No, let's... Let's do both at the same time. What do you think? Oh, my goodness. Do you want, oh, come on, you want to do okay, it? do y'all want us to release the physical stamp set and the new digital stamp set at the same time? <laughs> you, you're right, Bootsy, sweetheart. She says that turbo volcano. There's so many people displaced on Montserrat. You're right. Years ago, that did happen. That did happen. They have, they have an active, they have an active volcano. Because my mother wanted to actually retire, and go back to her island. That's where she wanted to retire. But they have a semi-active volcano. You can actually hear it rumbling, like if you stay on the island. But guess what? They're still building there. My mother has land in on her island. My mother owns land there, and so. Um, 
Yeah, but Bootsy up, that's the that island has been devastated certain parts of it. Well, let me show this one more time for those that came in late. De Debbie Laverne and others who hadn't seen this. If you go to the website, the Mind is Crafting website, on the first mm -hmm. page, you see that first image? You scroll down, you'll see the next thing. And right underneath here, it says free digital download on the first page of the website, Harley's Doghouse. Right. So you just go right here, put in your email, subscribe, and then it'll tell you what your next step is. Right. It's not on the in the store or nothing like that. So. <laughs> Look, Marsha, she's so sweet. She said, yes, release both. Then she puts, or whatever is easiest for you. <laughs> we, we can do either. Ah. But, uh. Okay, Christine. Christine says she has Bye, to get back Christine to work. Bye, Christine Brian says, no, the more live streams, the better. Y'all are too much. Y'all are too much. Asia says, time for recess. Gotta go. Asia! Wait, wait, recess? <laughs> wait a minute. I thought y'all was... Time was for recess? Stuff. What? Asia, right? Let's... Asia. She's Asia. talking... Asia. She probably told the kids, all right, y'all, uh, just... Uh, We're going to have two recesses today on this Friday. We're all right now. <laughs> here, take these and color it while I go over here and do some work. Look how cute that Until is. Until recess. Brenda Bowers says, mom should start selling blankets. Some of us don't have moms to make such quality. Oh. I'd certainly buy one. It's cold in the north. Yeah, she, I think she doesn't want it to feel like, it's just something that she does. I, I may have to ask, but it's just something that she does. Can I hear this? It's just something that she does. I think once she... It's a hobby for her, and she really enjoys it, and it keeps her, you know, she it's just something that she loves to do. And I think if it turned into a business where she felt like she had to keep, you know, putting them out, putting them out, it wouldn't feel as, I don't know if you don't, I'm, I'm trying to make y'all understand <laughs> my mother's mind, frame of mind here. She's trying to keep it so she doesn't feel so... Um, like forced to put those things out. I mean, she's gonna make them anyway, believe me. But she's, you know. Yeah. Bootsy mother. sweethearts tarts. I said sweetheart. Sweet tart says, "I'm listening and watching while sewing my small scraps into large, crazy patch pieces." The oh, that should be nice. With tiny fabric snippets. Okay, I I gotta make. I made Hartley a house, but I gotta make one for Heavenly. Pam Pertle says some EMT fire rescue services take cro crochet Afghans and quilts to give to people needing comfort after rescue. Oh, yes. Good idea. That's a good idea right there. Okay, so I'm doing Heavenly's house. Hers has the design on it, you know? <laughs> Hers has all of the, you know, the stripes and stuff on it. That house is coming pretty cute. They'll look at Hartley's house. And I see, I'm used the alcohol marker to color him in. And then I will use my um, watercolor marker to just to go in here. So just having some fun here. Waiting on my sandwich. You waiting on the sandwich? What's a sandwich? Can I have a sandwich? <laughs> okay, so let's see. I'm going to color her. I like shades of pink for her, but I might do her in like a purple. What do you think, babe? Maybe like a purplish. Hi, Kathy. She slept eight hours last night. Kathy who? Kathy from Skippy. From oh, Australia. yeah, yeah. Hey, Kathy. Hey, that's a nice it's amount 5 of sleep. Where she's at. I wish I could sleep eight hours. Yeah, Even you, if I try, for some reason, it just doesn't do happen. You sleep in pockets about two or three hours. You wake up another two or three hours at some point. Yeah, I'm a pocket sleeper, I guess. If that's even because a you thing. have ideals and it just springboards you right out of well, bed. Well, I'll dream about something. crafting though. 
Sometimes I'll dream. I, do y'all do that? And I'll dream about like on a complete card I made. And, and then, then I have to go it. make it. <laughs> <laughs> dream it and then make it. Vicki Jensen says she hasn't crocheted in over 30 years. Vicki, and I bet she... Now, Vicki, since you haven't crocheted in over 30 years, do you think if you started now, you would like remember like everything or you think you would have to watch a couple of tutorials to re relearn? Or is it something that just stays with you? Karen Hankerson says, I do not have a printer right now. Are there physical stamps of the digital? No. 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 Because for those digitals, what happened was... Someone asked us the other day, was any rhyme or reason? When we make a physical stamp set, it's more, much more involved in it. So we think in terms of a total theme. And the theme is much more deliberate on those compared to the stamp set, the, uh, a, a digital stamp set. It's theme oriented, but it's different. Because some of those, some of the digital images we're going to put out are just going to be any, even individual images that we sell really low just because we know you need, like, like Marjorie may say, hey, you need, I need a red truck. Bam, here's a, a truck image. I'm just giving you an example. Not that we're going to do that. Watch. Somebody's going to write me. <laughs> Where's the truck? <laughs> he, said said he said it. He said it, y'all. No, I, I gave you an example. <laughs> ah, Bill. But you got the basic idea. Mm. Deb C says, yes, she was dreaming about die cutting just last night. I know. As if we don't already craft enough, we got to dream about it too. Boosie Sweetheart says, her church is having a fundraiser concert for the local food band. I am singing Code of Many Colors, Dolly Parton. She's trying to make a crazy patch vest to wear. So she's sewing as fast as she can. Kathy says she crocheted herself a weighted blanket when she taught herself five years ago. Bargie says, ah, red truck, Bill. Red truck, I heard you say it. Now I was giving an example, Margie, an example. Look, she's going to be like, is it ready yet? As an example. Is it, is it ready yet? Is, is it, it ready yet? Is it ready? Is, are, is is it ready? The Bill said, yeah. <laughs> No, I didn't say we were going to do it. Oh, Karen said she missed us yesterday. Oh, that live was funny. My mom makes me laugh, you know? She's just so like... That was funny. She at the end, do you have any words of wisdom? To probably, no. <laughs> she sure I don't have no say words. That. She said she have no words. <laughs> I have no she was words. like, I, I, need, I have one word for y'all to leave my house so I can eat my oxtail. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's the word, okay. Okay, Mardell Lamb is asking Tracy... My alcohol markers bleed when I use VersaFine ink. Do you have that problem? You know what? I don't. I just used it on here, actually. Are you using it right away on your... Um, Memento ink might work better for your alcohol marker. But I use I use VersaFine. It's like the only ink I use right now. But there's a Memento... Is it Tuxedo Black? The Memento Tuxedo Black, um, which I just ordered one for myself just because I want to test them out. I gave away my other Memento black ink, so I got I went and ordered another one for myself. It actually will be here today. Um, but I'm thinking, are you allowing, the when you stamp out, are you allowing that ink to dry on there too? And I try not to get too close to my edges, but right now I'm using it with my, this is VersaFine ink, and I'm using it with the um, watercolor my tumbos, my watercolor markers. This <coughs> one is actually an alcohol marker. <coughs> what was the question? <laughs> Let's go back. What was the question? Oh, you want the question again? Yeah. The question was from Marty and Lamb. Tracy, my alcohol markers bleed when I use VersaFine ink. Do you have that problem? I don't have that problem. This one, I just used the alcohol ink with the VersaFine. Is it something how you can get the question? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Why? And you ever see like watch, up in age. watch like the uh, sports shows or different shows and they'll ask them about five questions at a time? Right. Don't so, do that to me. Jimmy Smith, <laughs> uh, 
what were you thinking when you came across the the the, 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 the finish line of the, the such finish such. line? Uh, did you just use the so and so one hundred super engine stuff, and did you get the car painted before <laughs> the race or after? And how was the pit crew and were they selected before the? Come on, man! Ask you one question. I, I forgot the first one. <laughs> that's too much stuff to try yeah, to that's funny Bill like what was the question I see reporters at news conferences they finally get picked on and I promise you they would they would ask the longest question the question would be about five minutes you don't have no idea what they're talking about <laughs> look man I don't even know what you're saying no more Angie Rutland says I wish we could all take a nap I told her she, she says they're not having recess today. I remember when I was in the kindergarten or preschool or something, they used to make us take a nap, but we weren't even sleepy. Now? I was like, man. Now I love naps. I wish they'd make us take a nap at work. Y'all can go take a nap. Now. I'll watch a movie and, and take a nap. I know. When I used to work my nine to five job, I'd just be like, oh, I can't wait Please. till I could get off and go home and nap. And then all of a sudden there's this burst of energy the when you get off, right? The moment you'll see the toenails <laughs> cross Look. over the threshold of, of the door going out of, <laughs> out of the job. That's how it works. Yeah, that's exactly how it works. <laughs> Bootsy Sweetheart says she can nap standing up. Really? There's a standing joke in the military. I might have told y'all before, but the standing joke is that it was a guy staying on his watch because he was and he fell asleep. And you know how when you sleep, you can just feel something is wrong or someone's there. He opened his eyes and the captain of the ship was standing like right in front of him, about two inches from him, with his hands in his waist, with an angry glare in his eyes. Mm. And the guy who falls asleep, he goes, amen. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know you don't expect me to think that you were praying on your watch when it's obvious. You <laughs> that, but the guy that oh, that's what I'm going with, he said, I was just praying. And that's it. Well, I can't pray. I'm praying for the, for the ship. <laughs> that is funny. Heavenly is adorable, okay? Angel Rutland says she can't make them take, take a nap because they're third graders now. Oh, yeah, third graders. We're mm -mm. too big to take naps. Right. We just raise cane all day. It make you want to take a nap. <laughs> Hi, Black Ribbon Crochet Studio. Now, that's a long name. I like that. Mardell Lamb says, Memento doesn't bleed, but I like the clarity of the Versafine. Maybe I'm, I'm not letting it dry long enough. I let it dry just for a little bit. Like, now I just, I basically stamped, and I think then I just colored it in, like, right after. Um, but it, it, it stays pretty good. Black Ribbon Crochet says, I'm late to the party. You know what I always tell, say when people say that? You're right on time. You're on the schedule. Nope, you're late. Okay. Well, that's what I was trying to dress it <laughs> she up. She was trying to dress it okay. up. <laughs> two black ribbon I just crochet studio under the bus. I'm trying to be nice with this thing. No, you're she, good. You're right on the time that you that that, that the man upstairs. You could always watch. You could always watch us. This is the time he said she was to show up, and we're thankful that you're here. Hi, Carol. Carol says it's lunchtime for her. I could nap, but I have to work. Carol? Pam Pearl says, these are coming out so adorable. They can Aren't be they embellishments. Cute? That's what I'm making them. I'm just kind of making them like to just add to like a they card later on. Nice. So imagine having a bunch of these. You just say, sometimes you want to just have a quick craft. Something you can just kind of sit and do. Maybe listen to some music or whatever. Just kind of relax. So just start here, right? And then don't forget... You can resize these to make them smaller if you even want them even smaller than this. And here's the thing. When you look at this right here, when you look at this page right here, you, you don't just see the page. You have to see this. You have to see something else. What can that be? It's like the sculptor who looks at a stone 
And he doesn't just see the stone. He sees an image imprisoned in that stone. And his whole function is to just keep chipping away until he releases the image that's imprisoned exactly. in that stone. So use these images. Well, there you go. To release yourself, the inner creativity. Brenda Bauer says, is it just me or does anyone else get happy when packages that you order arrive at the door? Oh, yes, Lord. I got, one, have your name on. I got one coming today and I'm just super excited about it. I get excited when my name is on it. Mm. Oh, my name. Look at my name right here. <laughs> Ooh, I just love my name. Oh, I'm going to put her. Let's see. I'm going to put. Heavenly is going to go right here. Loopy says, 72 people watching, only 45 likes. Come on, They're crafters, busy. hit the thumbs up. They're busy watching. They're watching. All right, so now I could just add it onto my card. Now I want to go and turn this into a card. Ooh, Brenda says she just got two of them. She's going to be doing some crafting. She's going to do, you know what though, Brenda, I know like your hand. Oh, she just got, oh, okay. Her hand is healing. Her. Oh. But here's the thing. Just when you download those things, make you some images of rest scenes, arranged so that, and you can save those so that when the time comes, and you're ready, get ready, get, get busy crafting, you have goo gobs of scenes already ready to just print out and get rolling on. Or you can just print them out, and then when it's time, just go and get those your 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 folder full of those things. Like Bill said, goo gobs. You heard it, y'all. Goo gobs. That's a country name. Goo gobs. Hell, the people from the south know what goo gobs. Goo gobs. <laughs> yeah, goo gobs of. Uh, yeah, that thing. They know what we talking about. Brenda says she knows. She knows, right? She says she ordered treats for a dog, and the dog was excited. <laughs> Ooh, Asia Butler says, Tracy, did you get the birthday card? Asia, I didn't open it yet. I'm trying She's to trying save it. She's trying to save it, it Tracy. You're going, you're going to save it. Let me go get it right now. I no, I got to save it, babe. Okay. Look, Wait, look I'm going to get that Asia's birthday card. Okay, he's going to get it. Look, you think because he was his they, You want to birthday. share this with them. They need to, to see it. I was going to share it like you like when it got closer, when it got closer to my birthday, like my birthday is next Wednesday, I believe, the eleventh. Yeah, I think it's next Wednesday, something like that. Y'all, he done went downstairs. He done went downstairs, y'all. Look how cute that is. That's Heavenly's little house. He went and got. How are you gonna go and try to open my gift? Because Asia Rutledge is, she needs some happiness because she's no, he my heart and she's surrounded by children. He's right trying now. to come up with. Asia's supposed to be going back to work. She is. That's why she needs some happiness before she goes back. Okay, it's two of them, Trace. Hmm. No, that's for my sister. Oh, my fault. Yes, that's for my sister. He's trying to open up my sister's gift. I didn't even read it. Bill, you really going to open Asia, this man is I'm over here. I'm Asia. She's going to be Look, she's today. like, Asia said, you can do what you want, Tracy. Exactly. Right. And I chose. And we're <laughs> choosing to open it. Look, you hear that? That's what we're doing. My husband hijacks my gift. Let's see. Asia, it's getting open, okay? Everyone wants to see anyway. Don't y'all want to see? Y'all hear this man over here? They do. Here? here you go, Tracy. Wait one moment, Ooh, babe. Ooh, look at one thing that came out. Look, I'm not even going to... Hold up. Okay, let me move this hold stuff up. out there. I hadn't even saw the card. We're going to take a, a, take a card up. break. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. This popped, but when I first opened it, this popped out. That I already got excited already, just seeing that right there. If y'all saw this pop out of the bag... Before y'all got anywhere near the car, wouldn't y'all get excited? <laughs> You'd be like, ooh, what's going to come with that right there? Okay, here, here, I'm going to give it to you. I'll let you pull it That's out. That's a sneak peek of what's going to happen ooh, next Ooh, girl, year. I'm scared to pull it out now. Ooh, Asia. Asia, I'm scared to pull it out. Asia, Asia don't make you do gotta, it. Don't let me make clear it do the it. desk off because this is so un... This is... Ooh. What is he this? already threw my day off when Chelsea came walking in the door. So now he really... He's getting scared. <laughs> Wait a minute here. 
Everybody's like, wait a minute, hold up. When you got something like that pop out the bag. Oh, look how Ooh, pretty. Look at that, something that. coming out. Look at this. Okay, so. Asia. 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 Brothage. Look, cause it, this one, you know you're in trouble when someone's like, Asia Marie, I don't know what your name, your middle name is Asia, but Asia Marie Rutledge, what have you done now? And they look at this in it. ribbon. Oh my goodness, the animal print. Asia, y'all. she's gonna use the ribbon. You could have just know sent I that am. and she'd have been happy. You know, look, I'm already putting it. Look. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta put it on that dog animal print. Right there. Asia. Asia Rutledge. Ooh, that kind of looks like the dog. Asia. What's beyond this right here? Everyone was dying to see you open that thing up. <sighs> Y'all are just Ooh, that much. ribbon. Black ribbon crochet says that ribbon is life. That ribbon is life. Asia says she doesn't have a middle name. Well, it's now Marie. Asia Marie M- Rutledge. Asia. I'm looking through here and I see something happening. We just renamed Asia, didn't we? Asia, you large, your name is largest, the largest continent, just about. Well, actually, Africa, but Asia's pretty large. <gasps> oh, 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 wait, 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 Look, handmade with love. Okay, handmade with love. I got to show y'all this. Yeah, side. you got to open it so they can Let experience me it at the flip. same time. Okay. Who heard it? You got to flip it they can see it. Okay, Bill, let me. You're messing it up. <sighs> y'all. <laughs> Ooh, come on now. I'm going to show y'all. Let me make sure I got it positioned right under here. Oh my goodness. Asia, Asia, Asia. What is it, Tracy? If you don't open that thing up, we are going to just this cut through the screen and rip it out absolute, right off. This is absolutely gorgeous. People, please tell them to pull that, that thing Is out. it? Ooh. This Ooh. absolutely Asia. Oh my you go goodness. Closer. Asia. You go closer. Jenny. You just went. Me. Bill, I'm pulling it up. It's delayed on there. Okay. Ooh. Asia. Look at all of the elements of this. I just can't even. Oh my Asia. goodness. I am in love. Asia, you put that's some kind of gel. What is that? I, look, I'm already I'm silent, y'all, because I'm trying to figure this out. This is oh my goodness. Debbie says, wow, how did Asia do that? It is gorgeous. My Tracy, mouth dropped open. Enjoy your birthday. I hope that you celebrate all month long. And there's the little froggy from our stamp set. Debbie says, how did Asia That is so cute. She says, how did Asia do it? She's Asia. That's how she Ka-yute. did it. Cute. Asia. That is just, oh my goodness. She put that Asia on that thing. Look, Bootsy said, Asia, my birthday is August 10th. (laughs) Mark it on your calendar, please. Asia, this is, wow, look at that. Little plastic thing right there. What is this right here? Some kind of gel. Oh, my Asia, what kind of gel is that in there? Let's see. Asia's going to tell us in a minute. Asia, what is in there? Stop screaming at Asia. She's about to answer the question. That is, I'm celebrating all month, okay? The blue stuff looks so cool. It looks like a sea or something, water. That is oh, so Oh, she says cute. hair gel, hair styling gel. Oh, oh, my goodness. What made you think, hair, what made you think you put hair styling gel in there? It's got the bubbles in it, it and everything. It looks just like water, kind of, like, like ocean. Look at the two fish. Ooh, Asia, the decent stuff, girl. It the 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 ooh Asia Asia ooh 
Look, <laughs> Lupe said, I'm a November, <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Everybody put their birthdays up there. October. <laughs> My daughter's birthday is, Mar look, March 19th. <laughs> David says, now we're going to all have to go to Sally's Beauty Supply and get the hair salad gel. Hair gel. Look, I need to just go right over in Ariel's room. And get her. <laughs> that is a good idea. Oh, wow, look at that. She said she saw it on YouTube. Oh, my goodness. I see. Look, I'm looking. Look, I'm looking. I am in love with that this. That is awesome. That is. Ooh. So now. Oh, my goodness. I'm just like, look, I'm looking at it now. Oh, she's like, analyzing that. She's reversed it. She's this is this a, baby. This is a six by six card. Oh, my goodness. Six by six in measurement. Lori Buckleton says Dollar Tree has blue and clear oh. hair gel. Mm. So it's a blue hair gel then. Oh boy. I like the bubbliness of that. That hair gel has that actual bubble what, on what it. What type of hair gel was it, Asia? I mean, who made it? Because I like the bubbly. Well, all we have to do is look for um all hair gels, most of them have like the bubbliness, but all we have to do is go look for um one of the uh I think we can just look and see. It'll be in a clear jar. So look. <laughs> she said, oh, she said you could spread the gel around. You sure can. Look at that. And then it settles back. Look at that, babe. Oh, Brenda says there's lots of videos using styling gel, lubricating gel. I, I would have never, never thought, of thought about this. Look how awesome that is. I love it. Oh my goodness. I'm just I <laughs> Stephanie Beth says probably dippity do. Who remembers oh, that? I remember, remember some dippity, dippity, dippity do. do. I remember the commercial. Dippity, I ain't heard that name in and years. everything for dippity do. <laughs> I Hold remember up. that. Agent said it's a men's hair gel. Can you still smell it? I can't smell it. Wow. I'm just well, fascinated. Thank you so much, Asia, for Asia, thank you so much. For increasing my wife's happiness. Asia, thank you. Wow. I'm blown away by that card. <laughs> I am you blown away. You gonna put the away. ribbon on there? That ribbon was nice. I am so really so blown away. I'm keeping that ribbon, okay? It's gonna be used for something. Not sure yet, but it's gonna be it's gonna be on a it's gonna be on a card or something. I remember Dippity Do. I remember that too. I heard that name for so long. Dippity Do. You know, back in the day, see, they, when they made commercials, you will remember for the rest of your life. That same, yep. You remember Ho, Ho, Ho. Remember that? Yep. Green Giant. <laughs> I can't forget that if I tried, okay? They have commercials right now. I, can't, I can watch them a hundred times. I can't tell you what. How many of you have seen a commercial where someone's riding a horse across a beach and to this day you have no idea what the product is? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, Tracy? No. <laughs> I bet somebody's seen that to this day. I, I'm like, what in the world are they trying to sell? What are they selling? It's a horse. Huh? I'm just like... I'm trying to have figure out how to reverse engineer that card that, <laughs> that Asia just made. That's what I'm trying to think about. Brian says November 4th here. <laughs> Y'all are too funny. Hi, Anita Smith. Hey, Anita. So glad you're joining us. Exactly. I would say you're not late. You're out on time. But you're a late girl. I'm not just kidding. <laughs> Trying to make my card bases here. I wasn't going to make a card out of this, but I figured, hey, okay, might as well just go ahead. Okay, so for those of you, tell them, Bill, about the digital stamp, the digital. Um, Which one of the videos or what? Um, no, this one we're using, the, the Hartley's House. Okay. Hartley's House is a free download. It's on the front page of the Minus Crafting website so just go there sign up and get it yeah i'm still trying to figure out how i can get y'all these downloads 
I want to start making at least one download a month. So y'all can get to it. A free download? Yes. I think y'all would love that. Yeah, but I got to figure out how to make it work. I'll work it out. Um, I got to show, while she's doing that, just to know for new people, if you go to the front page, right on the front page, you see that scrolling thing. You scroll down, and right here to say free digital download, Hartley's Doghouse. Just free thing in, and it'll come right to your email. Yeah. Brenda Bobwin is researching. She says there's a lot of videos using silent gels, lubricating gel. I wouldn't even thought to look that up. I guess I'm in love with it. it. I am an absolutely in love with that card. Angela says when she grows up, she wants to craft like you, Asia. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Hi, Huntress Habits from. Hartley's house. Or I could go this way. I don't like there that. There you go. Kind of liking that right there. That is going to be cute. Uh... It already has some dimension on it, too. Now, this was a fun live. That way. Or this way. Hmm. Yes, Anita Smith says, have you ever thought about incorporating your stamps with junk journals, like making the stamps the theme of the junk journals, maybe? I've been into making those lately. Hmm, I never thought about that. That's a great idea, though. Where's my sequins? Somewhere where Bill can't knock them over. That's true, Loopy. I guess I could do that. I could have a page. Technically, I could right-click on it, copy it, and paste it, or something like that. I don't know. It's going to be easy. Whatever we come up with, <laughs> we've learned a lot in this last year or so. So whatever we come up with, it's going to it's going to be easy for y'all to access. But we have so many images that will, would have never gotten released. Um, but. Oh, Brenda Bible says, you do a close up on that card. Because she's on the phone. So it looks really small. Okay, hold on one moment. Okay, Brenda, give us one second. Alrighty, so this is what it looks like. It's got a little bit of dimension in there too, which is nice. But you can use whatever background you want on these. You can do a, a spring house and have flowers coming out of this way and that. Uh, yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Oh boy. Mm-hmm. You can have flowers all over the place. It's just so many things you can do with. Now I want to do something with hers. Hmm. Y'all, I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking. I'm just going to do it. Not thinking. Thanks, Anita. Anita said it's really cute. Just trying to make it so y'all can like Say, hey, I could do that. Thank you, Loopy. Also, Hunter's Habits. And so what I'm using is, um, I'm, I'm actually using the, the uh, Dog Lover stamp set. This is the one I'm using for these two. But we also have, this one has Hartley on it also. So that's another one you could use. It's just up to you. It's up to you what you want to use. You can do whatever you want. Well, there you go. Let 
And this can be like that friends for life um, sentiment it can be used on just about anything. If you're just trying to send somebody a card and you want to send them something really cute, uh, you can just make just make them a card that says friends for life. Send a card just because. Does anyone do that or do you just wait for a happy occasion? Which to me, every day should be a happy occasion, right? Every day that we wake up. Exactly. That's why I like those, just because it's whatever the day it is type situation. Mm -hmm. Just because. Oh, Melissa Japata says today is my youngest child, Matthew's birthday. Well, happy birthday, Matthew. Happy birthday, Matthew. It's his 29th birthday. You say youngest, I thought it was going to be like six or something. Okay, well, there you go. Happy birthday, Matthew. Debbie, she finally downloaded the doghouse. It's easier than she thought. I told you, Debbie. She got the doghouse. <laughs> and did you see all the videos and stuff that I, I put all the links and everything right to the things you would need in order to learn how to manipulate um, the PNG images or whatever right there. Thank you, Brenda. Brenda says it would be neat to see you use an assortment of uh, your stamps to do a mini journal. Oh, that's a good idea. Or one paper little book. Hmm. That'd be a good idea, Brenda. And thank you so much for that super chat. Oh, thank you so much. Brenda, I'm, I'm, not looking at the, I'm not looking at the screen here, so I <laughs> whatever Bill says goes, okay. Brenda Bodwin. Thank you, Brenda. Let's so see. Brenda, did anyone, anyone ever call you BB when you were growing up? Hey BB. You know, she's like, like nope, and don't name. start now. <laughs> Brenda's like, nope, and do not start right now. Y'all know I've been loving doing this kind of stuff right here, so I'm doing it again. I think this has become my substitute for stitching. Cute. Now I could go in, and if I want to tie in the colors, it's going to go over here. If I want to tie in some of these colors now, I could just kind of do something like this, right? Just to bring in the color. Oh, Crystal Tarver said, do it the long way. Too late, Crystal. She said, do it the long way. Hmm? With the card, I think. Oh, you did the long way, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, well, you must be going way back. <laughs> I'm sorry, Crystal. I'm way, I'm doing something. I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, you could do it either. Brenda says, know. actually, Tracy, small children, they do call it BB. Oh, really? Hey, BB. <coughs> I can see it because it would be easy to do. Hey, Miss BB. This is so, this is some rainy day crafting right here, y'all. None, you know of what, this was, none of this was lately. None of this was a um <laughs> we got flash flooding. None of this was oh. rehearsed. Because I wasn't even gonna make a um card. I was just gonna kind of just stop and you know how we get though. Just one more thing. So Bill, are we gonna drop both stamp sets tomorrow? Have we decided? I think they said yes. We can, right? <laughs> we can do this. Yes, we can. Marsha Freeman said. Do what you want, but <laughs> she had that. However, Melissa Zapata says she belongs to a group on Facebook called Creative Card Angels. They send cards of encouragement to those going through hard times, such as sickness of, of families who have suffered loss or something like that. Mm. They have a lot of groups on Facebook. They have a lot of wonderful thing. groups. That's a wonderful You can find a group for just about anything on Facebook. That and they have so a lot good. of, yeah. They have the like the cards for soldiers. Yeah, a little bit of everything. Oh, thank you, Loopy. She put the link up for the dog lover stamp set. I forgot to do it, but yes, because I'm, I'm sure some people wondered where that thing was. I'm so busy, it kind of slipped through my mind. You ain't that busy. Brenda <laughs> says she volunteers to teach personal defense to preschool children. Once oh, a month nice! At an after school program in the city. That is so wonderful. That is really wonderful, to be perfectly honest. One thing Tracy and I always talk about, you know, um, is, uh, how would I word it? Um, 
like like sex trafficking and some of the kids that get taken and stuff like that. It would be great for priests for kids to really know how, what to do in, in case something like that happened, you know. Or they try to get them. Or, of course, you want to run. And it's so, it's, and, a, it's unfortunate that you have to even think to even have to explain to a kid something like that, you know, just to, you know, but it's almost like a conversation that you have to have to keep your kids safe. I can't even imagine. We used to have our kids, you know, just come and scream stranger, 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 you know. But it's just like she said, it's a shame. No, I would walk them. It is what I would do when my girls were little. I would walk them down to the, um, to the bus stop. And wait. And then I would, I would have them walking. Then I would drive my car and I would tell them, look, if you see a car pull up and that person decides they want to like talk to you about something, I would tell them to run in the other direction of the car, like back up toward the like the other part of the subdivision. And then there were certain people in our subdivision that we knew would be like a safe place for them. So there was just so many different things. But for the most part, we actually and got them right what? after school, and, didn't we? In all honesty, we lived near the corner. So there were so many girls, like Ariel had, so everybody was Ariel's friends. They would all come over and sometimes they would wait until a certain time. Parent, yeah. Then they would leave out of there yeah. when it got closer. Yeah, it's just so much stuff. It's a lot. It is a lot. And, and, and I'm thankful even that, that you know, Brenda, I'm happy if you would even do something like that. Yes. Some people feel they're too busy to do that. Well, they had something at the church. Uh, they did. For, um, we, remember Ariel went we um, sure to, there. with one of her friends about safety. Well, and right. um, it, it was like a sex trafficking uh like awareness sort of a awareness thing. thing yeah and they had like the sheriff's department come out and it's a shame that you have to have that talk but it was much needed i felt like she needed to go and hear what they had to say you know black ribbon Cro crochet studio said we used to use a code word when our kids were little mm, yeah my daughter's like even texting i have a certain code word i wanted to use but i they know i like to hear a voice i have i call i want to hear your voice I don't trust the text. But if I do, if you do send a text, if it don't come with that word, believe me. Oh, that is so cute. Uh, and they got, look, I got his bones on this one too. <laughs> got the little bones, so you could put a bone somewhere in there, you know. Just have all kind of stuff. I'm, I love you. I'm using like a little bit of everything on this one. You know what? You could have took that cat and put it right on the top of that house. The one that overlooks. Like he's hanging on the stuff. What are you going to get me? Bill's talking about this one right here. Wouldn't that be cute? Ooh, I see the sandwiches have arrived. Sandwiches! <laughs> well, I'm not getting it. I'll make myself something. Bill, you didn't get anything? No, because I don't oh, can't my eat the bread. No, but you could have gotten something else, which I thought that's what you was going to do. I'll, I'll make something. He didn't get anything. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I was going to use this right here. But I wanted to see. Let's see if this will fit. See, my new diet requires that I have bread in, a, in very minimal, uh, you know, Bill should have gotten himself something. No. You could have gotten something. Nope. Can't do you could, it. No, I'm saying a salad or something, babe. I can do a salad. That's what I do. You know what? I had a great salad yesterday. You did. I think I'll do that. I'm going to get a huge salad. I like the fact you can make the salad as big as you want. They don't care about that. Oh, man. David Laverne says the complex where she lives, uh, they just got a letter from the office about sex trafficking in Tampa, and that it's the number one place for sex trafficking. This makes a summer turn. Yeah, it really... It's just... It's just awful. You know, it's just... Man, Brenda? Brenda says she guess that the police, which funds the program, thought that, a, thought that a prepper, survivorless, former Marine, mother of 19, would be the best teacher. Mm. Oh, Brenda? Brenda's not playing. She don't... 
Look like I'm smiling. I'm about to... <laughs> 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 Woo! Look how cute she is. We can just run over her, please. Yeah, it'd be food this is going to be. Her. Susan says her hubby's cutting way back on bread. We have too. We actually, well, I'm going to cheat today. It's my birthday. Well, I mean... <laughs> yeah, it's a birthday month. Your birthday is actually on the level. Right. Bootsy Sweetheart says that I'd like some honey roasted pecans on my salad if that's no trouble. Ooh, yummy. There you go. Marshall Moore says, I like your style. Thank you. I love something free. Nice. Well, the whole key is to see how much can I give. The more you give, the more you kind of... That's the way of the universe. I'm hearing my girls come in the door, right? I can hear their voices. It sounds so good to hear their, both their voices together in one room. The things that you appreciate now that you're older, you know? Stop all that noise. Now it's like... Uh, I close it. You want to hear... No, now you... Man. No, that's fine. Now you want to hear the noise, okay? Oh, yes. You know what? I remember when, when, when Chelsea and they all them first moves to go to college and left... Oh my goodness. The house was just deafeningly silent. It was silent. The silence was almost overwhelming. If that makes sense. Because they always had something. That's the area. She had so many friends. Mm, mm, mm. There was always something happening. I don't know if I'm cutting this right, Chelsea but I'm going to try to fit it on here. Chelsea was a loner. So she was. She didn't, you didn't have to worry about that with her. Chelsea just kind of hung by herself. Every so often she wanted... Remember she said she wasn't going to the prom? She sure went. My there. daughter was like, I am not going to prom. This is my oldest, Chelsea. And she went to that thing. Mm -hmm. Then two days before the prom, hey, mom, I think I want to go to the prom. I dropped everything I was doing. <laughs> Let's go get a dress. Let's go get such such. Let's get this. Because oh, I didn't go to my I didn't go to my high school prom either, y'all. I'm like, I haven't vetted him yet. Who is this guy? Have him peeking right out. Look at this, y'all. Oh, that's gonna be cute. Well, this is your idea, babe. I'm just bringing it Ooh. into existence. Uh, bringing it into existence. So he has to be like right here. On the house, just just like how Brenda says, she knows what we mean. She went from over thirty voices to none. Oh my to goodness! None. How was that? Oh, that's gonna be cute. Oh, that's nice. Oh, isn't that cute, y'all? George Lee Adams says, what are you making? Well, what Tracy's doing, she's using the free download that we have on the site. The uh, the houses here. And she's the dog creating house. a crowd. How, right, she's creating a card. It started off as an embellishment, but it kept growing. It, it, it became so cute, we had to make a... Yeah, it was going to just be a card. It was just going to be just this. And then I just couldn't stop. <laughs> so if y'all are hanging on with me, thank you so much for staying on. Carmen says, can I have almond tortilla? I don't know. I'll have to look it up. Can you have who? An almond tor tortilla. Mm. I, pro I probably can. Because I can have almonds, huh? Mm-hmm. Now I'm going to be looking for it. Look at that cat peeking over the wall. That is so our cat, too. <laughs> Go close, real close. She would be on top of that house, too. David Laverne says uh, she went to a Christian school. And they didn't have a prom, but they did have a, be a banquet for them where they all ate and listened to boring speeches about going out into the world. Now, it's not that I didn't want to go to the that prom. So y'all don't want to know why I didn't go to my prom. I want to know. Requiring minds want to know. No, I told you. Well, they need to know why but that, did they will, to the prom. We'll stay on longer than you were cute, boy. I saw her back in the day. I'd have been. I always tell Tracy, Tracy, if I would have met you back then, I wouldn't have been interested I, in as you. Would, I'd have made you be interested. <laughs> Somehow, I'd be like, who is this annoying? 
that would have been like. What's this annoying guy over here? I'd have took all your classes, anything it took, okay? Bill, I was in all honors classes. Watch what he said. So was I. And so was I. <laughs> I was in national honors. Class. So was I. So was I. I was a student government. I was student president, class president. Either way, I'd have caught you one way or the other. <laughs> oh, Brenda, thank you. She Brenda. Says, I forgot to tell you how much I love and appreciate you. Oh, Brenda, you tell us constantly you how much you, and you demonstrate all the time. And we appreciate y'all too. We appreciate you, Brenda. We appreciate all of you. But Brenda, we, we've, got, we got, we've known Brenda for a long time now, seriously, on this thing. Louise Cassie says, because anyone give me good ideas what I can make with all the stuff that my daughter wants me to do what? To make? Oh, maybe her daughter bought her a bunch of stuff? Oh, she has a cricket. Oh, boy. Louise, you have a cricket, right? Post in the group and see, yeah. see what everyone says. Put it in the minus graphics group. I bet you'll have more ideas than you could possibly attend to. Oh, let's see. Where is my... Oh, here's my white gel pen. Because I feel like I need something in here. Louise is in our group. I'm just using the edge of the house to kind of guide this here. This came out really good for an unplanned card. <laughs> this is so cute. There we go. There we go. Let's see what y'all are saying. Oh, her mom, Carmina said her mom's birthday was um, March 10th. Rest in peace. Oh. Oh, well, there you go. Happy birthday to your mom, Carmina. Yeah, so like this, I can just put it on another card base and then just kind of make some stuff, right? This is just another thing that you can do. And you can put other stuff like... Uh... You can. You can make like a, um, let's see. Make somebody something like a, another house door. So I can take some of my leftover paper here too. And I can do like, look, just one more thing, right? <laughs> I can do something like, um, oh, what's those things that I use? To do something like this. So this is, you know, I love doing this with my scraps. All right, so we can just bend that over like that. Right, and then we're gonna cut it Something like that. Right, let me get that rid of that part right there. Anita Smith was asking questions about cricket and that sort of thing, but uh, she googled. Oh my goodness, there's so much cricket using. You're using Cricut on YouTube and a bunch of tutorials pop up. Trust me, there's a there, there I'm sure out there for <laughs> on anything you can imagine. And the beauty of it is if you watch the first couple tutorials and you don't really understand or it seems quote unquote under over your head or whatever, don't fret. Just keep going because there's someone on there who's gonna speak to right. exactly the way you, you can interpret explain it. Explain it exactly. It's just like that's going to teach it as clearly as possible. Talk to me like you're talking to a sixth grader or something like a seventh grader. I don't know these seventh graders. Sixth and seventh graders pretty fake, pretty smart. We went to a thing Ariel had one time. She was in the fifth grade, I think. And we had to go against the fifth graders. Man, the fifth graders knew more than I knew. I was shocked. I couldn't answer none of that stuff. <laughs> I kind of got scared. But I said, man, I went to college and everything. And I can't even answer these questions. Mm. That's oh, so I forgot to tell him why I didn't go to... Um... Yeah, you sure didn't. What, why didn't you go to the prom, Tracy? Well, it was the same day as the track meet. Or well, the state meet. The state meet, right. I was on the track team. I had been working hard the whole year. And so for me now to now not go, uh, it was either the state meet or the prom. 
And so, hey. So what she did, she went to the state meeting. She won the state championship in the quarter, the relay, and, and the long jump. Okay. Um. All actually, okay. that year I didn't. That you particular didn't. year, that was my senior. You won in, in that year, and what in the, senior year? In the relay. junior year. Junior year. Oh, that's right. We did win the relay. That's right. We won the four by one hundred meter relay in the um, state championships. Me and my sister was on that relay with me too. Exactly. I had people depend on me. Plus, I, you know, I wasn't like really into like having to go to the prom. Girl you know, like stuff. I didn't have to, like have to go. Uh, just, just didn't. I guess I'm gonna have to make this other card because the idea is coming to me now. <laughs> Bootsy says, Bootsy Sweetheart says, well, as a parent, I would have opted for my child to go to the state competition also. Exactly. Yeah, my mom didn't even have to tell me. She already knew. She was like, you're going to the state meet, aren't you? I said, yep. Black Ribbon says her lunch break is over. Or she has to go, bye. See ya. Brenda says, oh my gosh, Tracy, I would have done the same thing. Uh, she didn't go to the prom, but but not for that reason. Yeah, I just... Thank you, Joyce Holland. She's not just love watching you and your husband. Oh, thank you. I love watching your hands, Tracy. Well, thanks. Well, here's my hand, so y'all know that I have one. <laughs> well, he's, he's quite handy. I am quite handy. <laughs> I smell, I, look, I smell, I smell some sandwiches down there. Y'all, we did so much during this live. They left, went to go get sam sandwiches. sandwiches. <laughs> Not sandwiches, but sandwiches. Chelsea and Ariel left to go get sand. took my order and they're back, you know, and still during, how long have we been on here? Uh, we're doing like a, 16 minutes. We're doing like a live marathon. It feels like, huh? They're back now. They're like, y'all still on that? Oh, Brenda says she graduated early. So by the time prom came around, she was married and in the military, girl. You, you were gone, huh? You were gone. You know what? She's like, I don't have time for y'all. I was telling someone, I took so many classes in high school because I had so many interests that I actually graduated officially my junior year. But because I had so many friends that I grew up with, I just stayed the, my senior year. It just took, really, I went bananas that year. I took all kind of stuff just for the heck of it. But I stayed because I wanted to come up with my friends. But technically, I, I really was done my junior See, year. See, them friends, hanging with them friends. <laughs> hanging with them friends. Melissa says, Tracy, I have so many die cut machines, but I still love doing it the old-fashioned way. Oh, what, for these, like the little banners? Loopy says, oh, my God, really, Tracy, a banner? Yes, a banner. Add a little scraps, right? You see how little that little scrap piece of paper is? You can just do this. You can sit and and literally just do banners. And then you have those for your cards. So now I got to go and finish this card off. And then and then we're going to be good. We, we'll be finished. <laughs> Bill's like, yeah, sure you will. Okay, so let's get back to this. Let me find color here. Chelsea down there eating her sandwich. Oh, she's about to. Chelsea's working, getting sandwiches. This is the new school stuff. So she can, she's got, uh, she's works with this great company. And, um, and she gets to like kind of, she flew down here for my birthday. But she also gets to kind of stay, uh, she gets to work from home. How awesome is that? So she can work from home and still be like right here with me. As long as she has a computer, she can log in remotely. Now that's a job right there. Exactly. So right now I'm just lining these papers up. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them, but I do need some white card stock because it looks like I may have run out of some stuff. Susan Verinda says she had most of her points by her junior year. So she just took English and decided to volunteer to teach special needs kids in math and homework. Look at y'all smarties. Yeah, I did some volunteer stuff too. You know. Plus I wanted to play all I was I played all sports and I, I wanted to play I wanted to keep playing. Isn't that crazy? 
I can go back. I ain't never play nothing. I just went right to the left. <laughs> I had to hang with a friend. I just had to. Please. I can't Anybody. remember most of their names now. Let's hmm. see. You keep in touch with uh, oh, a pretty oh, good amount of your friends, though. Well, I have some that yeah. I knew forever, like Bobby, Ernest, Joe Price, all them, you know. That, uh, Marge said her son was in the Navy. Right. I was Navy Marge. You know that, right? Yes, Brenda, thank you for your service. I didn't even think that, but thank you. Okay, I'm going to have to cut this down. I'm thinking of the green, but then I'm like, mm, maybe, just maybe. Man. Let's see. I didn't know that. Tracy, Brenda says by the time her prom came, she was in Desert Storm. Oh, wow. Isn't that something at, else? At the prom, they, they, they said a prayer for her at the prom. Mm. Brenda, you have been to a lot of stuff life. in life. Life, okay. Oh, my goodness. Brenda could write a book. You could write a book. Please tell me you've thought about it. Sorry, Goobs. I'm dropping stuff. Gooby's right under my desk and I'm dropping things. Bootsy Sweet Tart says, it's nice to have lifelong friends. At this point, I only know one person who knew me as a kid, and that's precious to me. Isn't that something, Bootsy? I mean, I'm talking about the kind of friend like you knew way back when, you know, y'all was just little snot-nosed little critters running around the neighborhood. <laughs> snot-nosed critters. <laughs> you know, what is wiping Bootsy, what are you talking about? The closest you came to, to getting, the, getting rid of was wiping it on your sleeve. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking no someone who knew you back then. We, so now you you're like, I am you done grown up. Mr. So and so, the director of the chief of the you know, you have all these titles that you're hiding behind. Mm. But what that friend is no hide. They knew you were who you before you tried to put on that. Or you were you, suit. huh? They knew you before you knew you who you thought you were trying to tell everybody you was somebody else. So you need that kind of person that you can call up, girl, let me tell you. Hey man, and they say, man, don't worry about that. Just think about it. Remember the time you climbed that tree and you got caught and you did just, just apply that. Yeah, I do that. Brian says he's downloaded Harley's home. I think I'll get a picture of each of my five dogs and put the pictures inside the door that of Harley's house. That is a... Oh, he's going to post his dog Lucky's picture in the group. Brian, that is I can't wait awesome. to see it. I saw his dog too. The new... Is that a new dog that you got? Brian, is that a new dog that you have? I saw a picture posted. Hold on. Brenda he... says she was, laugh out loud, she was approached about 10 years back to write a book. I just can't sit long enough to do it. Crafting is the only stationary thing I can do and stay focused. Brenda, 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 seriously. Now, I'm going to be serious right now. I know I'm going to play around a lot, but I'm going to be ready to be serious for a second. Oftentimes when you approached, you know, you'll kind of play it off and you'll say what you just said right now. But you're going to constantly hear someone else like, like myself say, Brenda, you could write a book. Those are little promptings that are coming to you from that other place that are telling you, Brenda, write a book. There are people out there waiting. Your life is, is so rich. There are things that you have done. And, and you you are so inspiring. Trust me. When I say you can write a book, mm -hmm. you can write a book and just go on, on YouTube or go on to Google and, and, and write and type in something like how to write a book in, let's say, one year. And they will give you a construct that looks so easy. Write the title on this day, this day, this day, one. And it'll be so easy. Even if it takes you a couple of years, I promise you, there are people out there waiting to hear your story who will, will be able to move forward after they hear it because they can't until they do. I hope that makes Did sense. Did y'all understand you. what he just said? I hope that makes sense <laughs> to you. Sorry, y'all. I'm focusing on these banners. <laughs> she says they offer me serious money, too. And here's the thing. 
Look, my friend. I would have. One of my friends. I'm telling you, she's like a yes award winning. A national um, award-winning. Yeah, she's award winning author. Margaret Johnson Hodge. You see what and is. it started with a conversation. Didn't know that this woman um, had the idea of writing a book till I met her. Met in the library at Kennesaw Library. And we would just happen to just hit it off. You know, I was a librarian there and she started telling me, a lot of people would tell me about their dreams and their hopes and goals that they had and things that they would love to do. And just me being myself, I was like, you need to do it. Cause she had started writing it since she, when she was 12 years old. Well, we had that conversation in the library. Now she's an adult. Like I think she was like in her thirties, and she was. We were just having she this was conversation. A job in a bank and a um, she had just moved down from New York, so that was like the thing we hit it off there. And when I tell you, she didn't even have her first book yet, but she had the manuscript, something that she had been writing and holding on to since she was twelve, and never really released it. Next thing I know, I, she gets this book deal. For three books, I believe it was like right. that was in the contract. Just offer her one manuscript, and um, and all of them became national bestsellers. And wow! They wanted to, to, to do a, a movie. They on wanted to do a movie on one of them. Something. Or... And I have to tell you, I'm just always inspired by her story and and her just telling me, Tracy, remember that conversation we had? And um, it, it's just really like I love seeing when people like do that thing that they've been dreaming of or wanting to do. So whether it's the book, Brenda, or maybe something else, or for all of you that are thinking of doing something, you know, just go ahead and you just grasp on to whatever that thing is and you don't let it go and don't let anyone discourage you because it doesn't have to be their dream. It just, it only has to be yours. It's supposed to come through you. You know, just just saying. Right, because oftentimes you'll think you are dreaming. I'm dreaming of this book, but actually the dream is You've being it, given yeah. to you. And it has to come through you. It can't come through anyone else. You're being supplied the dream, and, and, and it's up to you now to go ahead and say, you know what? Okay, thank you for giving me this dream. Let me go ahead and manifest it. You'll think it's you, but it wasn't you. Anita Smith says, no matter how old you are, too, just do it. Colonel Sanders, didn't he start? Uh, he, he started he pretty was, late, didn't he? He didn't even start until he was about 60. And I eat more out of his chicken. Thank God he made that uh, going Kentucky Fried Chicken. I've got happiness from Kentucky Fried Chicken mm-hmm. from Colonel Sanders. Sanders. End up in the hospital, too. Exactly. But I was happy when I went there. I was happy when I went there. I said, mm. Ooh, Colonel, thank you for the, for the 59 years of happiness I had before I went. How about that? <laughs> Well, there you go. I'm trying to make this thing work, y'all. Before we get off this live, <laughs> I'm going to make this work. Making me a banner. And it's going to be covered up. This is how I craft when I'm when when I'm not making a video. Just kind of just do my thing, right? Just needs to have that. These verses, no matter how old you are, too, just do it. Just do it. Didn't, didn't, uh, I think Sarah had a, a baby at 99, but don't wait till you're 99. You know, don't just do it now. That's love. That's, you don't want to wait that long. On that one. But, but that's it's an just example. showing people it's never too late. Yeah, it's never too late. A little banner looks kind of cute, doesn't it? All right, let's go ahead and get the house on there and finish this up. Yeah, we can get this. Good. Brenda says, uh, she started, she just couldn't wrap around, she just couldn't wrap around the title. She titled it, Never Get a Teenage Boy Wet and Never Feed Them After Midnight. Now, here's the thing. What about, what's the name of the book with the chicken soup? If you can name something talking about chicken soup and it becomes a worldwide bestseller, trust me, you can put that title in your book. Oh, that's chicken soup for the soul. Yeah, chicken soup for the soul. What does that mean? Those it means like, wow. a worldwide bestseller. Chicken soup makes you feel good, right? It's for the soul. Right. Oh, I saw your title, Brenda. She says, Bill just ignored the title. No, I didn't. I'm just going back in time, looking at uh, stuff while I do things over here. O'Brien says he uh, 
he got the dog at 12 weeks. Now he's 12 years old, 12 and a half years old. In, in, in human years or dog years? Man, Anita Smith's whole family were military. Her ex-husband was a paratrooper, Tracy. They went to Granada. Her dad was in World War II. Landed on Utah Beach and fought in the Battle of the Bulge. Along with his four other brothers. All five sons in war. Wow. Man, all five? I didn't think they did that. Well, I thank you for your service. One. They wouldn't stay home, so. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put this together. <laughs> I've been saying that for a minute, huh? Actually, Brenda, someone will see that title and say, what in the world is this right here? I'm going to never get a teenage boy away. All right, let me just finish this up. So she gonna make that car happen, Ursula. I'm trying, cause my sandwich is waiting for me. And you've only been on two two plus hours. Has it been that long? We've been having so much <coughs> fun. <coughs> yes. Hi, Jerry Reed. Jerry Reed, we still over here. She doing says this. I'm late to the party. Well, Tracy, you early, okay? So you don't have to worry about all that strength. Because <laughs> it's going to be covered up, right? Chelsea's downstairs working. Ariel's doing something. Might be recording something. Ariel, how's your hair doing? Good. Ariel's in the room over there. And we're over here doing a live stream, having fun. Okay, let's see. Oh, Susan Marina says. What's the dog's name? Can, you can put Hartley and Heavenly. Could you put it on the banner? If we thought it out, you could, but yeah. You know. Um, the banner's too. Yeah, it's sure. It needs more. It needs more bannering. Right, you put a letter <laughs> on each one. But. Needs more bannering. Look how adorable that is! I'm gonna drop some little pink things there for Heavenly. Heavenly. <laughs> Those colors just work together, don't they? Not bad for some mindless crafting. My desk looks like a mess. You'd have thought I was over there. My right? sandwich is calling me too. You'd have thought I was at your desk. Huh? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Chelsea down there working. I'll have to send her her supervisor a thank you card, babe. For her being able to take off and just Yeah. Come down at the last minute. Such a good job. They really care about the happiness of their employees, which is nice. Okay, so how is that, y'all? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? And Those banners are something else, especially when you can just kind of do stuff with it. So, of course, to tying this, tie in the stitching I have here, I'm going to put some stitching right on my little, my little banners here. And I don't want all of them to be laying flat, so. Uh, let's see. Thank you, Marsha. Marsha said precious cards. And they're mindlessly made, right? 
Because this was not rehearsed for sure. <laughs> Carmina said, Romero says, the other day I was crafting, making embellishments, and I wrote it uh, on a card. Life is not easy, so take one day at a time and enjoy each day with joy, mm -hmm. laughter, love, and hope. Love it. So That's now if true. you want to tie in even more colors, say you want to put more of this, the pink, you could just maybe draw a line here. Draw another line here. Mm -hmm. Brenda said, thank you, Brenda. She says, Tracy, that Harley car would be an awesome get well car for somebody recovering from arm surgery for six to eight weeks. It's <laughs> <laughs> an awful full list split that hurts. <laughs> that is, you're hilarious. <laughs> Brenda Bob, when you are hilarious, okay? I just can't with you. <laughs> well, there you go, Brenda. Brenda is Say hilarious. No <laughs> Brenda's funny. Okay, so let's see. Got that. Just straighten up my banner a little bit. And I didn't glue every piece down. But you see how that just all ties in now and I put a little bit of pink in there. Okay, now I'm gonna just, I gotta do one more thing with some stitching. I knew stitching would have been in there somewhere. Well, it's it's here, but I need to put just a little bit more. And it's kinda cute. Uh... Gotta stitch it, y'all. This is gonna have shorter stitching in it. Yeah, so yesterday, Ariel had me do one of my childhood things that I used to love doing. Well, no, my, my mom thing that I used to love doing, which was doing their hair. So she was like, Mom, can you do some cornrows in my hair? So now Ariel, if y'all have not seen her hair, she's got a lot of hair, okay? And so I was trying to tell her, I have to, I need to put my video up. I need to record some videos. I need to such as all these things. So she was like, so, <laughs> mom, are you going to do my hair? So she's like, it's only eight cornrows. Now, no, it's, it actually ended up being nine cornrows. Um, now, nine cornrows would be fine if you don't have a whole lot of hair. But if you have the amount of hair that Ariel has. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> it's deceptively long. Yes, it's it's really long. It's almost like look at that. Look at like, that. Like see, yeah, see. Uh, yeah. That is so lovely. Just give me all a close up. And here's Hartley with the house, with the cat looking at him. Reminds me of our cat. <laughs> Who's the sleep they get? So that cat to... stamp set. Do we have any more of these? Ooh, I don't even want to say. I don't even know. Yeah, we, maybe I think we there. might. I think so. I'm not sure. I, I don't know. We're close to almost having no more of these. But um, the perfect friends, Bill. If you could put that link there. Which uh, one? Stamp set. Perfect friends. Uh yeah. That that's the the cat stamp set is still. I think we still have them. Uh. I'm not even sure now. You're about to find out. Okay, but tomorrow now, don't forget, tomorrow we're going to go live and we're going to... Um, do something. We're going to... We might do two of the stamp sets. Maybe one. Maybe. Yeah, we'll see. So we're going to do... Uh, we'll be... What time? About one o'clock maybe? Because we don't normally... Friday is not our normal day. So one o'clock tomorrow... Uh, one o'clock tomorrow we'll be live releasing with another stamp set release definitely the digital stamp set okay so what are y'all saying oh someone's getting their cast off well good congratulations you're not sure what it's going to look like underneath it. Well, you know, I don't heal up good. I'm sure it's going to heal up really good. Oh, 
Oh, y'all talking about some surgical stuff. Okay. <laughs> Did you put little sparkly things? Can you put sparkly things? I think if I ever had to get a cast, I would have to. I'd feel like either doing something, markers or Sharpies, having it signed or I don't know, putting some, some gems on there. Says, That's great. She's looking forward to tomorrow. Oh, nice. Okay. Brenda says, I love, love, love these cards. They turned out nice for just mindless crafting, huh? So start with the house. Go and download that house. Resize it. Go play around with it. Get the free download and play around with it and see what you come up with. Make them in different sizes. And, post it. and um, color it and, in or whatever you want to do. And you know what? It, it's something else I was going to say. For those of you that might have been apprehensive about using digital stamps, but somehow you took the plunge, after, in, in particular after viewing those videos uh, on how to use uh, the different constructs, uh, Google Docs, uh, Word, or what have you, go ahead and leave a comment in the group or, and also on the Mindless Crafting uh, Facebook page, business page. Because a lot of people, they need to hear that you that you that you tried it, and oh my goodness, it wasn't as hard as you thought. And you know, upload some pictures. People love to see that. I love to see what you created. And you know what I'm thinking? This could be a, a little refrigerator magnet type thing. Just this alone, just the embellishment, <laughs> and then put your dog's picture or your cat's picture, or whatever. I don't know if you could put a cat in the dog house. You probably can, or whatever. And then. Put that, make a little magnet, refrigerate a magnet, or give it to someone that loves their pet and you want to give them a little gift. That would be a good idea. <laughs> someone wants to tell Brenda she can bejewel her cast. And Brenda says, this isn't a cast. It's hard black rubber that they form to fit your arm pre-surgery. Ouch. You can't move all of this thing. It reminds me of the Batman costume. <laughs> <laughs> I can visualize that. Oh, oh boy. Y'all are funny. Oh, my goodness. Well, this was fun. This was so much fun. So this would be nice in some refrigerator magnets. I think it would. Remember, I woof you, my crafty friends. I woof you. <laughs> and we are friends for life. Crafty friends for life. I hope this gave you some inspiration. Y'all join us tomorrow at 1 o'clock. We will be live. I'm going to go eat my sandwich. Go get your chicken sandwich from Publix because it's on sale all week. Um, and Bill is still writing. Bill, no, you got done. anything to say? You're done? No, I'm done. I made a mess today. Bill, I made a the mess. The thing isn't just me. But it was so fun. <laughs> Damn, Tabor says those cards are gorgeous. And thank you, Asia, for your lovely card once again. We enjoyed it. We're inspired. Love, love, love that. Thank you, Asia, for my card. I'm, I got to go show my my daughters these, this card. Like how it's just the level of card making is just so like there are no limits. OK, and this is just one. This is just one. This is proof that there's no limits. Right. Using hair gel. Yeah. Gel or whatever. Yep. OK, y'all, we are off to go eat our sandwiches. Bill's going to have his salad. Thanks so much for joining us. And. We'll see you real soon. Bye. Bye.